for grabbing this for my birthday uh, but yeah I did not have the mic on so I think it's on now yeah the green light is on so I think it's on now but I didn't have it on the entire like first half of this ride I just left my pants we're gonna head on back now I probably shoot down make a lap through the house and just get a little driving in and um, maybe we'll talk a little bit man but yeah testing out this microphone. I hope it's picking up my voice good. I have a really deep voice, so it doesn't always do too well with, with mic. So I'm hoping it picks up pretty good.
back at the house now. Got the trap bagged up over here, kind of out of the way. Uh, might drive it to work a day or two this week. We'll see how the weather does, but yeah, it's Trapper, man. That last clip that you saw of me just ripping this thing, man, that's pretty much the reason why I freaking love this car, man. This thing is a corner, like this is a cornering beast, man. I don't know what the proper word for it is, but if I ever, if I ever made it big enough in YouTube, that would be something I would enjoy doing with this car. I would love to take this thing like to actual tracks like the grid life type of stuff and just and just run it there yes i know it needs a lot more work to really compete or anything but right now i don't even want to compete right now i just want to get out there on some track days and just burn the road up some man but to do that i need to do a lot more work safety wise like with the uh harnesses and i need like a roll bar some type of racing seats and whatnot in here i need a lot of extra stuff that i don't really want to do right now which is why i say like if i ever make it big that'll definitely be probably what i end up doing with this car because like this wheel and tire setup man and it's just man this this car is freaking awesome this car is freaking awesome man and honestly man if i won't try to take something else i'd probably take this back to the dragon again just because this thing is just freaking phenomenal with the corners and it does not miss a beat guys at all so i don't know but i do think the cd5 would do great up there i do think that the turbo car would do great as well i just really need to do the brakes on that thing before we try to take that many corners at that type of speed but um yeah definitely options out there man there's a lot of options out there for uh what we could do as far as this car goes but it is definitely my pinnacle car and it definitely is not going anywhere so if anyone ever thinks that just because i don't drive it you are hugely hugely mistaken guys this car is like really what dri drove my passion to kind of pursue the youtube farther than where i was at this was kind of like our first setup on the channel. We did work on Keisha a little bit, but I want to say this was my first actual swap car on this channel. And I don't think there's a way to replace that. So uh, unfortunately, like when I do get bored or I feel like I'm gonna bore you guys with it, I do set it off to the side and I try to work on stuff to try to grow the channel, man, because although this is my favorite car there are a lot of people in the world that like just much more crazier things and um that's kind of what we're trying to do with this car over here once we get everything else man i might do a video on this too soon to let you know like an update on it if you're interested in that drop a comment down below what you think but i do have a bunch a bunch a bunch of parts that did show up from jack spaniel racing so huge shout out to those guys my guys always supporting the channel, so big thanks to them. I also do have Corlo's already by, you know, yours truly. So let me know, man. I could potentially do a video really soon on this thing and just give y'all an update. But I'm trying to shoot for a winter build on this, I think. I think I should be able to get the body whipped into shape over the winter and I think first of the year we should be able to go ahead and get the engine transmission and computer which is pretty much honestly guys when I think about it I think that's about all we need to make it work so yeah stay tuned for that man if y'all want to know an update on it and see some of the parts that we got so you can kind of get excited drop a comment down below I can do that video for y'all maybe sometime this week as well and have that out for y'all by Friday so yeah, let me know. But I guess that's why I'm gonna pretty much wrap this video up. I hope this microphone thing is working right now. All of that footage from the first half, I did not have it all. So hopefully it's filming correctly. Again, a huge shout out to Nisha for it. I appreciate that. I was thinking about getting it too. That's what's so funny about it. So she really looked down on that. But yeah, guys, with that being said, I will catch y'all next time. Remember guys, respect all bills. Peace out.